last three seasons in USL Championship, the spine, the guts of Detroit City FC remain the same. Well, if it didn't broke, don't fix it. Felipe Rodriguez, the 19-year-old, getting the start at the keeper spot, a very intimidating spot for him to be in. And there is Maxi Rodriguez. So we are ready to go. And soccer is underway at Keyword Stadium. Neil Rule, John Krieger here with you. Amu Mensa slots it up ahead. 70 degrees at the opening kick. And when we wrap this thing up, it'll be down to about 65 degrees, but you're not gonna find many better days than we have here today. Maxi Rodriguez, cross, looking for Ben Morris. Left foot shot is off the post. DCFC buzzing early. Joe. Williams, here's Morris. Morris lets it go. That shot's blocked. Mike O'Brien playing his 100th match for Detroit City FC, the Centurion. And there's a giveaway. Connor Rutz takes it. Maxi Rodriguez lets it go. And the stop is made by Felipe Rodriguez. Back in lightning quick fashion and Maxi does what Maxi does. Turns and shoots and a difficult save there. Rodriguez, I, I'm not gonna respond uh, to that. Know, yeah, you don't nope. know, I'm the only wouldn't, one that does that. Wouldn't, apparently wouldn't know in anything about that. Yeah, it's only me. <laughs> Here comes Joe. Joe, just outside the 18. Villanueva, towards the back post, a header! Stop made, rebound put in! Reese Williams, 1-0 City. They danced with the devil one too many times, and the bill just came due. In motion, in position, there on the follow, pokes it home, 1-0. Joke with a beautiful ball out wide, then the cross in, and the shot saved, but there on the follow, you put it home. And City take the 1-0 lead they absolutely deserve. There will be two minutes of stoppage time. Stoppage time brought to you by Brew Detroit, the official craft beer of Detroit City FC. Long ball up ahead for Villanueva. You know, in this stoppage time, we talk about what the message is gonna be at halftime for Detroit City. The message has gotta be keep your foot on the gas. Villanueva curls it in. Maxi Rodriguez. Nifty back heel from Villanueva. Here's Joe. Joe. Back to Villanueva. His shot feathered in and Rodriguez. Was waiting for it. Desar plays it out to the right side. Cardona. Knutson. Uh, Momenta plays it away. Rutz, the header. Maxi Rodriguez has Joe, has Morris. Maxe. Surveys the scene. Show up to the top of the D. Bryant will let it go and misfires. And the whistle sounds. The first half comes to a close. Reese Williams toe pokes ahead. Kind of runs is in. The shot and the stop is made by Joseph. Instead of staying stagnant and holding on to that one, you were one million percent correct. Here comes Joe has Morris with the Maxi calling for it. Maxi Rodriguez sends it just over top of the crossbar. 
to get there. And when you have had to increase your pace to get into a shooting position, sometimes it can be tough to control the ball. It's a beautiful ball down the wing and then the lead through here and you see Maxi, it's a little bit fluffed and spinning there. So he's got to catch up to it. If that comes, both of their skills as an attacker, because that's a run that two years ago, I don't see Connor Rutz making to dart through two players and get into a position where he was half a yard from being very dangerous. Boy, that was a great job done by Sebastian Joseph to keep that possession and then a great job by Reese Williams to take it away. <laughs> Reese Williams up for Ben Morris. Morris in and he chips it over top of the bar. Well, he's been so electric with his touch this season. How about Reese Williams? Stop there. Yeah. That's a heck of a play to leave it through. And then Ben Morris. Yeah. You're, you're stunned that he didn't connect on it. I'm, no, I'm absolutely stunned, given what his track record's been all season long. There, and, and he knows that. Down there in a lot of the areas we're all familiar with, right? You go on vacation, regions that we visited, vacationed in. Some of them are no more. I mean, you go all the way, the state of Florida and Tampa and up into the Panhandle and as far north as, as you know, sporting cathedrals like Augusta National and the Augusta, Georgia area. Here that comes Elijah lot. with Kisiedu, sends it across. The pass could not find its mark. Villanueva takes that away. Kisiedu has it. Kisiedu! Tudor City! You said he had some touch, partner. There's a little bit of touch. And a celebration to boot. Goals brought to you by Salim Dental. Kiss Yedu may have just closed down the club here at Keyworth going back through some pretty fun times. I got to say from a club standpoint, I would put this season at number one. Elvis Amo gets there first. Amo taken down. And a penalty will be awarded. Here in stoppage time. And Amo's going to pick it up and he wants to finish it himself. Unless the ball gets taken off of him. Steinwasher had an assist last year. Can Nate Steinwasher deliver? Oh, of course! Nate Steinwasher! 3 0 City! That Neil Rule is a special, special moment for a Detroit City Football Club legend. He's done it all. Clean sheets at one end, a goal at the other, the captain's armband today. Detroit City FC gets the 3-0 win over Miami FC. And City fans clear the calendar for two weekends from tonight because DC FC will be hosting a playoff match.